and I'm watching the rise And I wouldn't say I'm shocked cause I'm hardly surprised This one's for the ride, this one's for who knew I'd make it, just needed some time This one's for my wife, could've left a thousand times just to by my side This one's for the grind, I knew it would happen, just had to strengthen my mind To the videos, they thought I was a black guy mm, It's hard to get over Falling in this world, but I'm fully devoted. I don't take it for granted that the doors been open. I knew I was different. I knew I was chosen. A breadwinner, but I'm soft spoken. Authentic like a 5950, and there's no cat. We bother introing it again. Good morning, friends. Uh, it's like colleagues. Oh, we've got continuity issues and enemies. <laughs> You're in a different kit. You're in a different kit. Kit. Especially you enemies. Especially you enemies. There is so much. Vlogger content left on hard drives that just never gets used. Because we tried to do this 10 days ago? Yeah, so I was riding dirty. Both of us were. No tubes, no air. Freezer bird. <laughs> on top of the world. <laughs> Until uh, I got a full on complete slice. And so then I had to get a ride back. It was a whole ordeal. I went to Oregon. He won the climb to Kaiser. Got for it. All right, so we're doing one of my favorite loops. It's called the Grizzly Loop. Um, it's about 75 miles and a lot of climbing in the middle, like two thirds. So we're gonna end with a 4,000 foot descent. Wow, right to the door. Uh, we started with a good descent. So now we're just climbing into space. Problem on this route, no water until the top of all the climbs. So it's hot today. The final climb is, is a doozy, uh, probably an hour, hour plus. So we got to conserve on water, but the views. If we hold a moment silence. Hold your breath. Don't fly. All clear. All clear. And I mean, the road is so oh. good, so I don't even... Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> Mammoth Pools Reservoir. The gearing on this bike. What, are, what am I looking at, Tyler? 52, one by 52, 1152, 1152. So, so when the one bys came out like two, three years ago, everyone's like, we don't have gears to climb and we don't have gears to sprint. And I rode a one by that was like that. If you really wanted to make it the ultimate road bike, you could do a 54, 1152. So you still have climbing gears, but then for sure you have your speed. And the oval ring is weird. It masks the jump in gear ratio. The downside is that you go from a 46 to a 52. Okay, so it's funny. I completely forgot that you had the rotor on here. And it's only when I got out of the saddle, I said, gee, my legs feel good today. And I was like, oh, hang on, there's something different with the pedal stroke. Just quietly, this might be the best piece to camera backdrop you have ever done. That is... It looks like a green screen. <laughs> it really does.
Let's have a chat about the elephant in the room, Tyler. You running away to Oregon to avoid the shootout last week. It's true. <laughs> I, uh, I'm the reigning C2Q. Or, mm -hmm. Not the reigning, I'm a past. I'm a champion. And I was afraid. I was afraid of you. I was actually really bummed because, I mean, I was feeling so good. I was peaking. And what you and I could have done. I think it would have been interesting because we ride very similarly. Like, I was just whinging to him, I don't ride with many people. And that's mostly because of my timing, but also just because I ride pretty consistent, like endurance zone stuff. And not a lot of people like doing that. So we're gonna go left. We're gonna go left. Left turn. But this man behind me is a aficionado of very smooth endurance, which is what last weekend would have been, really. Geez, I would have had the excuses lined up. 10 year old bike. Um, no, because if I was there, I would, I would have, have had this. Ah, uh, but then I would have had, oh, the bike doesn't fit me. Uh, I would have trotted that one out. Um, what else? Total 9.5 climb. Oh, Jesus. Look at this. So now we're on, a, we're on a big climb. Oh, can we just quickly talk about this little computer up here? Because I, uh, I had some issues with the hammerhead last weekend, which you might be interested in. Okay. Basically, the battery went after I got to the top of Kaiser, and the battery was at 23%, which I was honestly considering giving up, because what was the point of doing that event if it wasn't going to be on Strava? If it, I mean, talk all the shit you want. If it's not on Strava, boy, it just holds no significance. No, significance. no, no interest. And the other issue, yeah, I've changed gears, hang on. So that was post my wrong turn, pre my wrong turn, I discovered that the screen at, when the sun was right at its highest moment, like right above us, like it is now, whatever the matte finish is on the top of that device, you cannot see the screen. Like you can't see it. So yes, I actually, I did a video on Wahoo versus Garmin. Yeah. That was one of my biggest gripes, that Garmin has this glossy screen that like I straight up can see my reflection. Yeah. I'm not trying to see my stupid face while I ride. Yeah. But Wahoo has this like brushed or scuffed yeah. surface and you know, no, no Wahoo sponsorship here, but boy, it's nice. Well, I won't be getting a Hammerhead sponsorship because it just doesn't work. Like, as wonderful as the, the UI is, I'm sorry, but I can't see it. Anyway, I put the screen down to 3% at the top of the climb and then I knew the way back anyway. Remember our, our RC Cola? From Mountain Dew? Through Big Creek, they go like Shaver Big Creek. On the backside. Yes. Hold that door. <laughs> I can't thank you enough for that, man. That was awesome. Yeah, man. That's um, definitely one of my favorite loops. And it actually wasn't as hot as I thought it was going to be. I don't know. How bad were you on water? Were you out? Like... I, was, that, I, was, I was at the limit. Okay. That was it. There was no more left. Yeah, I brought four bottles and I was done. Yeah. So, um, but either way, man, I'm stoked. I'm, I, we were able to... Uh, part two this. Part two this. I did offer that Tyler makes his way out to Australia, but then having just ridden that route with him again, I'm thinking maybe a few laps of Centennial Park may not be really up to it for you. Anyway, man. Hopefully, see you soon. Peace. You left your bag out on the front porch. Kristen said the bear was getting into it. Serious? Uh, <laughs> so she moved it inside, but he was poking his nose around in it. Holy shit.